Brawn Team is a remake of Wreck, one of my favourite horror movies, but does it live up to the original or is it just a cash cow? So it starts off pretty much identical and throughout the movie it's essentially a shot by shot remake. There is really nothing new this movie adds. I would say at the beginning when they're at the fire station they spend a little bit too long on there. They extend the scenes to try and build up the characters but it never really does. It's just tedious and it feels a lot longer than it should be. You only really need an introduction with the fire team and the camera crew and then you could literally just go on and move on and then have that as the movie and then build the characters whilst they're traversing through all these twists and turns but instead we get like 30 minutes of oh yeah this is the fire department they're eating cake let's let's have some cake let's let's flirt a bit let's have a little fight let's i don't remember it being as long in wreck and when they get to the actual um flats themselves it is pretty good and it's pretty pretty enjoyable it doesn't feel like you know you're you're wasting a lot of time when watching it so it has that enjoyment in it uh, the infection and the like description of the infection being like rabies i really really like that i really like the similarities and parallels they brought towards rabies and this it actually makes you think about rabies a lot more because as they're saying in the movie there's not really a way to treat it when someone gets completely infected uh, yes you can have like a rabies shot and stuff like that early on but as soon as you go feral there's not really a way of coming back and i absolutely love the direction that took with the let's call them zombies and like they they weren't exactly like quick turners the zombies but as the film progresses like they they, they turn quicker and quicker and i don't i don't know why that is but it keeps the action going it keeps the pace of the movie i do wish we got a little bit more time with the doctor character because him explaining the rabies and him kind of looking at it was very very interesting and really really pulled me in i'd say it's probably one of the better things in this movie I think our leads were just okay. I don't think they necessarily drew me into the movie any more than they could be. The ending, I kind of wish they didn't put on the promotional poster and like they showed it everywhere. I would have liked it if it would have been uh, a lot more subtle, but that's just how movies are these days. I don't know why, and it's just really irritating, honestly. But yeah, if, you, if you've seen Rag and you're you're willing to watch like a foreign movie, I would say definitely check that out because it's an amazing, amazing movie. And it is just like an adrenaline rush, like it's non stop. It's just go, 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 go. And it keeps you on the edge of your seat. Uh, Quarantine is a decent enough American remake, so if you don't want to deal with all the subtitles and stuff like that, probably check this one out.